There's a totally different book that I've written about partition. I totally stand behind it. I think it's one of the most beautiful things I've ever written. So if you like the lyrical writing in Map and the Scissors, definitely go to Partitions, which was published in 2011, because that is, you know, it's right into your veins of all the the, the, the beautiful writing and the imagery and the, the sort of dark, beautiful, violent, uh, you know, type of stuff, right? In the sense that, are you talking about the prologue and then and then the then the book itself? Yeah, so the prologue is there to basically show you what is going to happen down the road. And then I'm, and then the mellowing out is where, because I'm starting then with, with the youth of Jinnah and Gandhi. So you can see their trajectory where you have this sort of mellow guy, you know, this, this sort of quote unquote mellow situation uh, got, you know, Jinnah's studying law in Britain and, you know, all this stuff and they have family life and they have political life, they have rivalry, and then it escalates and escalates and escalates. And then you find yourself towards the end of the book, you find yourself in Noakali, right? Gandhi is walking through Noakali. And then that is what dovetails with the, uh, with the prologue, that taste you got of what was coming. And then I take you back to it. And then you have Jinnah in a refugee camp, you know? Yeah. And so then you see how we've ended up at that spot again. So, yeah, that was very deliberate. It was an architectural decision where I was going to show you, give you a little taste of what was coming and then show you the innocuous and innocent ways in which two people having debates and, and, and working politically all ends up culminating in this, you know, catastrophic stuff. Right. Yeah. And so the difference between partitions and map and the scissors is that in partitions, um, there's no Jinnah, there's no Gandhi, there's no Nehru, there's no Sardar Patel, there's no anybody. It is purely regular people. It's just regular folks um, caught up in the division of Punjab, basically. Okay. okay. And they have to find their way across the border and they end up meeting up and, and this, that, the other. Now, with the map and the scissors, it was the result of a feeling of incompleteness on my part, as far as my understanding of and literary treatment of the partition. Because from a novelist standpoint, if you said, if you asked me, hey, do you want to write a novel about innocent people getting caught up in really dangerous historical events and trying to survive? Or do you want to write about two old guys debating politics? I would say I want to write about the first thing because I know I can get an audience like that. It's right. very, it's easier to write about that because you can have, you know, sympathetic characters and really, really intense scenes. And it's there for the taking. It's low hanging fruit artistically. What's the difficult thing? Taking two guys who uh, are very idiosyncratic follow their entire life and have them argue and then have it culminate in the partition of India. Which one of those two partition novels do you want to write if you had to write? So I think I did it in the right order. I think that if I tried to write this novel, Map and the Scissors, if I tried to write that with my abilities in 2011, I might have not done a good job of it. Okay. I grew as a writer and I grew, I did more research. I, I learned more stuff. And I also... Um, probably, you know, just gained my under, gained a little bit more understanding of how to write this particular type of book with real life historical characters given fictional form. And, um, and so that's the difference between Map and the Scissors and Partitions, but they're complementary. And uh, I stand by both of them. I think they're both, I'm proud of both, both of those novels, but I, I don't even consider them to be sibling novels. I consider them to be very different novels fundamentally different novels, but they're about the same exact topic.